<laughs> Hello and welcome to Verm Lunch TV with me David Thomas and me Sarah Pitway. Today we're down at the business park as requested their subscribers. This episode is going to be called The Two Evil Twins which are the uh, Samuel Fieldsport Imps. We've already had a little bit of recce and uh, we've seen some squirrels, some birds and uh, a few rabbits. So we're going to see how we get on and uh, get you some footage guys. So we've set up the uh, barbecue table uh, and we've got a target set out at 25 yards. Just check zero in so we make sure that the rifles are shooting true to the cross here before we go out. Now we've had a walk around already and we've seen quite a few pigeons and squirrels so ho hopefully uh, we might get, be able to get a few of them today. You can yes. see both rifles there, Davies, they're near enough identical apart from the scope. Davy's got a Hawk SR Pro uh, and I've got a Hawk Panorama on. Great shot. You got that one, mate. That jumped, didn't you? Yeah, that should. It's not far. It should. It didn't go far. It's somewhere behind that tree. Is it dead? Yeah. Went straight through it. It's close. Oh, nice shot. Where'd you get him? In the sweet. Nice. Yeah. These tough little buggers, aren't they? They are. Yeah. Definitely. Yeah. Yeah, I'm on him. Oh, beautiful shot, mate. Well, there we are. There's the uh, magpie you saw. The culprit. Culprit. 41, did I say yeah, it was? 41 yards, yeah. 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 With the imp. Dropped him dead before he left the perch. Yeah, definitely. Okay. There's a woody. Okay. This is the uh, pigeon, second pigeon I've just shot. I uh, went for the headshot, and you can see the imp placed the shot just about perfect, wasn't it? Yeah, nice shooting. Just to, uh, just to the side of the eye, look. Dropped it cleanly. So I'm happy with that. Well, taking a little bit of a break from the business park today, we're supposed to have been filming uh, the second part the two evil twins with the imps but the weather forecast yesterday said it was going to be really windy uh, where the business park is so uh, Davy's gone to his mum's birthday party anyway but as look at it today it's not as windy in Gloucestershire where I live uh, so I've come out uh, see I've got the imp just here uh, and hopefully uh, I'm back on one of my permissions which is one of the pig farms and hopefully we might pick up uh, 
a pigeon or two. There is a bit of a wind, but uh, it's not as bad as it was supposed to be, uh, where the business part was. Uh, and if I get something, obviously I'll edit this into uh, the Evil Twins, because at the end of the day it's all about uh, the imps. Well, unfortunately, uh, since we finished filming the first part of the business park, uh, the management's changed uh, and there's a lad there now who works at the business park who also shoots uh, so he's been given uh, the full shooting rights uh, and me and Davies uh, now have been basically told that because the other guy's shooting it uh, we're no longer welcome to shoot it uh, which is a bit of a, uh, a pain uh, especially when we've uh, donated so much of his time over the last few years to shoot it but that's what happens you know sometimes management changes uh, and they know people who shoot and you end up losing it, but not to worry. So what you will see is uh, footage uh, from around Man and Davis permission using the imps uh, and hopefully uh, you'll still enjoy the rest of the episode. What a shot. <laughs> well, would you believe it? First shot of the day. I'm really, really pleased with that. I was five and a quarter mil dots of old over. Luckily the wind, like I say, were coming straight at me. It gave a little bit of uh, elevation extra for the wind coming at me, pushing the pallet down. Uh, but hopefully as you'll see, when I take the uh, footage off the shot tracks, he went down. Please with that. Forty-two meters. Just checking the windage. Oh, yeah, as I thought. Needed three mil dots of old over on times ten, and a quarter mil dot of wind.
a lovely shot. That's the same uh, type of shots I like. 37 metres, as I said. Um, nice safe backstop. If the pellet would have missed the, uh, the rabbit, it had gone into the bank, into the soil, so there was no way it was going to go anywhere uh, dangerous. Yeah, really nice. I made my morning, that has. Sandal feels sports in. So here we are. Here's a rabbit. It's not a bad shot placement. Oh, it's gone straight through, even at 37 metres, straight through it. Really nice uh, shot placement. And it looks actually like I've done this rabbit a favour. I thought it looked a bit uh, slow in the uh, scope. I don't know if you can see that. Uh, yeah, look, it's got myxomatosis. Uh, so, this rabbit uh, wouldn't have lasted too long and it had suffered. So, yeah, it's got early signs of mixy. That's not good. Not good to see uh, mixy on your, on your permission, but yeah. At least it's not going to suffer in the long run. What I've just noticed, I've taken a closer look at the rabbit without the camera on, is uh, not only can you see, obviously, probably there, the signs of mixing, but all this first come off as well. And that's the first time I've actually seen a rabbit where the fur comes off like that. So it was really going to suffer, this rabbit. So, yeah, I'm really pleased that I did see it. and. Uh, managed to dispatch it with the imp uh, like I did. There's Davy, with his pigeon, 57 yards, 2 mil dots of wind. Nice bit of pigeon breast there. With a Sandalfield Sports Imp 2-2. Oh. Getting me a nice shot. Twenty five yards. Wood pitching that. Quite pleased with that. There's about three quarters of a mil dot wind on that one. shot 34 meters about 36 37 yards
that's just robbed me pigeon. He just rolled off of me pigeon, look. <laughs> well, okay, that was a, a good little session. I'm gonna call it a, a night now. And I'm gonna get the snipe out and uh, see if we can get some rats. Um, as you can see, I'm, I'm wearing the leaf suit because it's quite an opened area here. And the birds are only 20 yards. The first column is. Second column is probably about 30 yards. So I'm trying to blend in with the background as much as I can. And uh, it's paid off. Well, there you go. See it? 